Our greetings to Edon and the progressive and revolutionary youth of Cyprus and to comrades from around the world. It's my pleasure to bring revolutionary greetings from the Young Communist League of the Communist Party USA to the working class of the world. Um, it's the working class youth and students of today who will suffer from the disastrous effects of imperialist aggression, of economic collapse, of climate change, and war. And it is youth of the working class who are fighting like hell to change these conditions and to build socialism. With the resurgence of broad socialist movements in the US, our party and our youth league are experiencing unprecedented growth, a resurgence of organizational know-how, political power, and ideological clarity. Our young communists take pride in helping lead the fight back against US criminal justice system and its infamous racist police and prison brutality. We take pride that our members are providing leadership to the militant upsurge of strikes and union drives, and especially our efforts in organizing Amazon warehouse workers, which if successful will be the first Amazon organizing drive in the US to win a union contract. We take stride, uh, pride in uh, leading the struggle against fascism, which continues to menace our country. At, at this um, Congress, I believe it's our task to reach out a hand of peace and friendship to our brothers and sisters, um, to build peace movements and anti-imperialist solidarity in opposition to war. We must strengthen our resolve to oppose all forms of ethnic, religious, racial, and national chauvinism. We must bring together all sectors of the working class, men and women, differently gendered immigrants, ethnic minorities, to fight the imperialist racism that menaces all of us. We must not give an inch to the false promises of bourgeois nationalism, whether it comes from Trump or any other source. We must learn from each other as we seek to urgently rebuild our cadre and organizations to the fullest extent possible so that we can provide leadership and unity which only the communist movement is capable of doing. Uh, let me conclude by reading a lyric from a great American communist and a folk singer, Pete Seeger. Um, Tomorrow is a highway broad and fair, and hate and greed shall never enter there, but only those who've learned the people's way of brotherhood, we hail that coming day. Um, youth is the future of humanity and of the world, and that future has a name, socialism. Thank you.